Hi, this is Terry. I've lost 180 pounds with a combination of keto, carnivore, and counting calories. I started my journey in August of 2019 and reached my goal in November of 2022. Now that I've reached my goal, I'm focusing on my health, both physical and mental. Thank you for watching. Okay, I'm doing a trial run just to see that my stuff did not fit in that cooler. So I had to resort to this cooler. So I'll even be taking my Fairlife milk. So I'm going to be taking this cooler. I'll be taking this cooler. This is going to have things like my apples and my chips and whatnot. So this and um, I think I have a, I don't even know what all's in there. Anyway, so I will be taking that cooler tomorrow. And I'm going to put that back in the refrigerator. But that cooler tomorrow, that's my crochet stuff. And that is my suitcase. So, um, yeah. So, in the morning, I've already got my coffee made up. Because I didn't want a bunch of dirty stuff in my sink and dishes. So, um, I went ahead and ran my coffee. I've got this note for me that my coffee's in the fridge. Um, I've already ran the dishes, so these are clean. Um, <clears throat> so, yeah. I'm going to make put all this back. It's going to be on this shelf. In the morning, I've got my one rutabaga and my drink and that's what i'm gonna have hey i thought i had more more of my baffles that i was gonna keep out well hmm i wonder if i put too many of them in the freezer no no i better pull i better pull one of them out because i don't hang on y'all hang on i'm not seeing any i'm not seeing any of them i better pull oh i know terry Oh, my stars, you guys. I put them down in there. So those are the ones I'll eat when I get back. But anyway, so yeah, I'm going to put this and this on the top shelf. And I'll show you everything when it's loaded in this shelf. Hang on. Okay, there it is. We'll see. When I get to mom's house, there might be a revolt. And I might not be able to take stuff. Um, we'll see how it goes. All right. Bye. So I've got my... Thing packed. Push that down. We're talking about pulling over. Well, at stopping, not going through a um, you know a restaurant. So I got my burgers on top. So if we eat, I'll grab two burgers, and I've got my protein chips in my crochet bag. This screw is kind of my I don't know my, my stuff bag. So I got my crochet stuff, and then my um, my iPad. So, um, <clears throat> when we stop to eat, <clears throat> or, you know, whatever we do, um, if it's, uh, anyway, when we stop to eat our own food, I'll pull out a couple burgers and um, a bag of chips, and that's what I'll eat on that. Let's see. So, I've got my, my water here, my purse, kind of checking all the things. I've got, you know, I'll, I'll go through this on my own. Um, my suitcase is ready. I've got two pillows. That's my wrap for what I'm wearing and my coffee. Um, I'm going to go ahead and make my breakfast up because I'll drop the dogs off. Then I'll come home to grab my stuff and I'll eat on the drive to mom's. So that's my plan. Meanwhile, got all the dog doors closed, got the alarms, all the all alarms go set. And these alarms are going off because the dogs are all inside. So every little movement, it picks up around here. So anyway, so I got the inside alarms on and the outside alarms on. I'm looking around. Everything's good. Everything's copacetic. There's my girl. Hey, girl. So there they are. They're ready to go hang out with their friends at daycare, guys. Okay, the babies are dropped off. There's a the place up there. They're already outside. When you bring them in, they take them straight outside so that we can run and play and potty and whatnot. I'm not driving on the street. I'm just like in, in a parking lot. I just wanted to tell y'all. So we're not breaking the law. We're just in a little parking lot right here. But anyway, so puppies are dropped off. Now back home to get my stuff and off to Judy's. We're at a rest area. <laughs> we're at mile marker 150. We haven't even gone 100 miles yet and we had to stop and go to the bathroom. There's Missy walking. She likes to walk, so she's up and going. That's our first stop. We've, uh, I guess we've been, we, I guess we've been on the road a little over an hour. But uh, I think it's mile marker 150 or something like that. But <clears throat> anyway, 
Here we are. I had to go to the bathroom. Bad. It's a nice little area. It's got pretty, pretty out there. Up oh, and here comes Judith. Y'all say you want more Judy? Well, here she is. Judy, Judy. Judy, Judy. That's my girl. We're in a gas station right now. And this is where I always stop when I go to this, to Jeff City. Tempting, but no. At my sister's house, and this is her little girl. So I'm getting dog therapy since I'm not going to see my babies. So on the drive, I pulled up. We pulled over, and I had two burgers. One bag of Quest chips and one apple. So I already ate that. So <clears throat> Susan's very into um, decorating. Try not to get faces. That's a, I think that's a door. Hang on, I'll show you. And she made this. It's a wooden thing with hangers, and she made that. She's just really, really crafty. I'm not going to go into the doors, into the rooms, but this table. She's the, she's the one in our family that's, like, good at decorating. That's, that's Susan right there. Susan and Judith. Susan and Judith. I leave it in there. Two peas in a pod over there. They're good for each other. I don't know if I told you guys, but I have had the two burgers, a bag of chips, and an apple at lunchtime. And then I just went out to the car and um, I had so another burger and now, about huh? three pieces yeah, of, so I like that size, yeah, of the raw rutabaga. Just kind of peckish, so. We're going to be getting to the lake. We're at my sister's house, so we're going to be getting to the lake in about an hour or so. So we're on the second floor, but they're really, really short steps, and there's 24 of them. So we come up, and then this is our, our room. Hey, that's me. And then <clears throat> this is part of our balcony, and we have a balcony over here. Let's go in and take a look. i got to step up so I don't... I don't bust my face. All right. I'm not going to hold y'all too close in case I drop you. But look. Oh, it's a screen. Oh, man. Nice. Nice. So we won't get eaten up by skeeters. But look. So I don't have to worry about you all falling off the ledge. Oh, goody gum drops. Isn't that pretty full? I don't know if people go down there and swim. I have no idea how this place works. But there's boats out there. And look. Look. There's somebody with a ski. Or a speedboat, but that's where everything is, and this is the way it's set up. I wonder if this says Chiefs. It sure does. That's funny. They're Kansas City Chief Rocker and oh, Ohio State. That's funny. All right, now we're going to go through the house. I'm going to not show you the fam, but I'll show you the place. So hang on, let's go through. That's the so, kitchenette. So how'd you open it? There's a little button right there. Oh, I did it from the inside. Oh. All right, so then this is our little bistro table. So then here's the kitchen. And to the left, there is a bedroom and a closet. And then here is a bathroom. 
in the shower. Like it's me. Hi guys. Hello. I love you guys. Okay, so now we're gonna keep on going. So again, now we come out and make a left. This is how I play my video games. I just kind of follow on the left. This is a, let's see what this is. Huh, like a closet. We found they have a, a laundry room and they have an extra fridge, which is cool because I try to consolidate my stuff to that spot and that spot. Then they can kind of, there was already, all this stuff was already in here when we got here. And, um, but, and there was some detergent and anyway, and so we you come around in here and this is a second bedroom. I got my suitcase and we got a TV and this is this bed. Look at this fun wall shiplat. By the way, their AC is not working. We're all hot, hotter than Cooter Brown. And you know, Cooter Brown is hot to trot. And then here's a bathroom. It's and uh -huh. oh, but this theme is blue okay and so then there's like a little shelf looking thing and a gnome so now let's go into this side so come out here's another door what's this got you ah oh, yeah that's that's the place where they've got somebody coming because the heater or the air conditioner is not working Harry can you see what that is 87 degrees. Y'all know I'm a delicate flower. This this ain't gonna to be too swift. Anyway, and this cute little thing. Picture, and then in here is another bedroom. This is a bigger bed. So this would be with the king bed. And so this person will have access to out there. And a TV. And yeah, yeah. And then, and then, <clears throat> Uh -huh. and then, <clears throat> tigers because you know we're in mizzou country so there we go this is where we are they ordered pizza and it's not here yet but this is my first salad and i got my dressing and stuff on it and i've got three burgers so this is gonna be my supper and then i also made up an orange protein shake. I used the whole, no, it wasn't orange, it was pumpkin. So I made it with my Fairlife milk. I didn't look at how much. It's part half Fairlife milk and half water. And then I think it was pumpkin flavored, um, pumpkin flavored protein powder. So um, yeah, so anyway, so I'm going to eat. And they'll eat when theirs gets here. All right. So I'm gonna eat. I'll let y'all put your eyes on me. I'll see you later. Yeah. I don't know what we're doing tomorrow, but this is my supper. I love you guys. Bye.